cultural fit is a theme that I see in our threads here as well, mm -hmm. Barb. So in the interview process, how do you how do you gauge that? And when you hear from a potential or even existing employer, well, you lost out because of fit. What do you where do you go from there? How do you assess that? Right. Often when they say you're not a fit, sometimes it's their culture, but usually the person that interviewed you didn't like you, you know, and they're not going to give you feedback because you just didn't click or you might have been too analytical and and they don't need somebody that that's analytical. They needed somebody that's more, uh, you know, outgoing, aggressive, you know, that type of thing. So when they say, you know, fit, often that's the personality of the person with the people they would work for. Cultural fit, though, again, when you read what a company says their culture is online, it almost always is not what you experience when you go into a company. Um, there's a big disconnect between what companies think they are. The, the company culture is what the employees say about the company behind their back. So the best thing you could, could do is connect with past or current employees that work at the companies you're targeting and let them know. That, that you wanted to network with them, that you, you loved everything about their company. And what's interesting, if you network high enough and you're asking about the company culture, there's also employee referral programs, even at high levels. And if they refer you, they get a, a referral fee. So it's in their best interest to network with executives that are looking to make a job change. But you've got to talk to somebody that either worked there, currently worked there, worked there in the past, or if you know somebody that sells to the company, that's a customer of the company, or they have a family member that works there, try to connect with people. And by the way, a company culture changes from one department to another. If I'm in sales and marketing, the culture of that department is probably very different than the accounting department is. But the overall, and, and also look at look at who they back, like what are their philanthropic endeavors? You know, if you if that's important to you, are they giving a percentage of their sales to worthy causes? You know, look at what they back, read what's being said about them, read the press and media, and also set up Google alerts for any company that you want to possibly target, set up Google alerts. And that's going to give you everything that's being said about the company online. And then when it comes into your inbox, set up a rule where you set a folder for each company because you don't want your inbox full of, you know, a ton of Google alerts. But then the Google alerts are what other people are saying about the company. And that usually is more accurate than what you read on the website. The only other thing I could suggest is if you're there, they are hiring executives on contractual levels of basis right now, contract to hire. Um, and often they're doing that when they've had an executive, you know, change you know, leave a job, you know, very quickly. And there's certain firms that, that, you know, that, that specialize in that. If you're not working and you're an executive, you might try to get a contractual job first. And that's a working interview. You're checking them out. They're checking you out because you don't really know the company culture until you get there. You can get a pretty good feeling. Um, the only other thing is if they're using any kind of assessment tools, if they're using, you know, uh, to, to hire and most, you know, many companies do, that shows you that they're trying to match you with the company culture. And so assessment tools are not a bad thing. Assessment tools are a good thing. And if you have to talk to their company psychologist before you're hired, they want to make sure you're going to be a match. And so they're doing their best to make sure that they're hiring the people that are the cultural fit as well. 